And there's the bell. It's every man for himself in a fatal four-way. Oh, Michael, she's one of my favorite divas. She's so good at being bad. Here she goes, back in the ring now. Wearing down the opposition here. She's clearly not getting paid by the hour. Once the back goes, it's nearly impossible to stand, let alone deliver any offense. What can you tell the WWE Universe about Stephanie here? A ton of talent, a ton of ability. Certainly someone to keep an eye on. And again, the mind games are played. There was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. Well, that's any indication she's not taking any prisoners in this one. No, she's on a mission here. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Is it enough to put an end to this one? Man, that's gotta hurt. This is the cut. There's no coming back from that. The creep! Back between the ropes. She's having a real... Oh, not again. Not again. She appears to be extra slow regaining her base. Oh! Oh, watch out. Two major blows with that weapon did significant damage. If this isn't enough to win the match, I don't want to know what's going to happen next. I've seen redheads before, guys, but Eva Marie takes it to a whole new level. Oh, we're talking neon red. Wow. Oh, Nikki Bella knows how to polish off an opponent. Seeing attacks to the back of the head reminds me how thankful I am to be sitting right here. Yeah, I wish I were as thankful. Big elbow. Well, we're on the move here. We're looking at complete domination here. With this kind of attack, you have to wonder just how much longer they can compete in this match. Yeah, I completely agree. The way things are going in there, I'd say not much longer. My gosh, this is a beating. Wow, look at this onslaught. What a counter that was. That back was clearly part of her game plan heading in. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. Guess what, King? I agree with you again. Eva Marie does take red hair to a whole new level, although sometimes we've seen her act more like a prototypical blonde than Total Davis. Oh, man, Michael. I'll tell you what, Eva Marie messed up doing ring introductions for 3 and B. almost fell off my chair. I've never heard a ring announcer make such a mistake. And I've seen Tony Jimmel. They're not dreaming. This snapmare is for real. What a move. Man, you land hard after that snapmare. I like it. Let's get this thing done inside the ring. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. <laughs> look at Stephanie. Stephanie McMahon, that's how you put an opponent away for good. Yeah, Cole, Stephanie McMahon showing who's boss in there. You know, guys, I'm a little shocked at how unpredictable Alicia Fox has become in recent years. I don't know why you're so shocked, Michael. Alicia Fox has been pulling fast ones on the entire locker room ever since showing up as Edge and Vicky Guerrero's wedding planner. She's having a real hard time getting back to her feet. Oh, she does it again. And a slap. And down goes Alicia Fox. Slowly back to her feet. Come on, ref, get in there. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Thinking to avoid that. You made a good point about Alicia Fox earlier, John. I guess we should have known something wasn't right when the wedding planner was running around with the groom. Oh, my. What a move by Nikki Bella. That's got to be it. I'm telling you, Nikki just getting better and better with each passing week. There doesn't seem to be any slowing her down now. Oh, out of nowhere. 
what a wild attempt at striking your opponent. I don't know if she could have been further off the mark. <laughs> that was like a haymaker. Like she was taking that big home run swing. Nikki Bella doing a great job of turning that around. This match has taken so much out of her. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. What happened to you? You're using the steps as a weapon. She appears to be extra slow regaining her base. Oh, clothesline! After you're on the receiving end of something like that, you wish WWE had timeouts. Not today, too fast. Not this. And Alicia Fox makes her pay for all that. When you're beat up, the last thing you want to have to deal with is this amount of power. That landed perfectly. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation. Incredible. This has to be it. And Nikki gets knocked off her feet. This one's not over yet. We've seen plenty of people. Oh, wow. The Shiranui. Brutally painful. What a finishing move. This could be it right here. I'm glad I have a library card. Because I really like checking her out. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. She's going to need to dig down deep if she wants to keep going now. No blood loss between the... It's all over but the shouting. Every time she has to get back to her feet, it takes more and more effort. Second time's a charm. There's a drop kick. She's clearly not shy about proving her dominance. She's having a real hard time getting back to her feet. She's got her. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. No kidding, this is getting ugly. Even if you can get back to your feet after a move like that, at this stage of the match, you're still struggling to find your balance. Oh, wow! 